So it may look like I'm about to have a swap meet in my own yard, but no, we just unpacked Dave's uh, wagon, returned from Florida yesterday night, and uh, look at all the stuff we got from junkyards. Well, most of it's from junkyards. A couple things we bought from other people. So uh, let's see what we got here. Well, first let's start with on the ground. Let's see, we've got a 96 PCM for an LT1 out of a Caprice. Uh, we've got a drive shaft uh, out of a, one of these B-body uh, wagons or sedans. And then let's see, we've got an aluminum drive shaft out of a Crown Vic, which will fit one of these. Uh, let's see, got a piece of uh, cladding here for Dave's Custom Cruiser. I'm going to grill for a Roadmaster sedan, a sway bar for a B-body sedan, two of the elusive Buick braces, which are found in the RMS, uh, but can be used on the Caprice or Impala sedan. Found a red uh, leather armrest console from my custom cruiser. Uh, what else we got on the ground? Oh, bumper shocks for a box Caprice for somebody uh, on the forum. Uh, A-arms, Dave decided to grab spares for some reason. Uh, Dave got some lights to match the interior color of his custom cruiser for the rear doors. Arm, uh, Roadmaster sedan cornering light, times two. And then, uh, oh, rear view mirror and a whole bunch of wiring. Oh, that's the one out of that 9C1, that uh, compass temp mirror. And another 96 PCM. That's a piece of sheet metal for Dave's Impala SS for the rear quarter. We cut that out. And these we cut out. These are rear quarters uh, off of a Roadmaster sedan for Dave's rusted Roadmaster sedan. Another piece of piece of run channel molding there. An air filter that a mystery air filter that we don't know what it fits. Somebody gave it to us. Now, let's see, what do we got up here on the top of the car? <laughs> well, let's see. Got a uh, airbag steering wheel with audio controls for the um, for mod into the custom cruiser. Uh, spare red bezel and switches for my custom cruiser. Reading lights out of a H-body, uh, 87 to 91 H-body LeSabre. Steering wheel horn button from same. Another one of these airbags. A roll of duct tape. Well, we bought that in the bubble wrap. The bubble wrap worked nicely. A couple of uh, custom cruiser tail lights. Filler panels for a uh, old 98. A TBI 9C1 uh, silicone hose. And we've got a uh, the dark colored wood grain bezels for Dave's Lucerne XM7. We got leather seat skins for Dave's Lucerne. Uh, we've got a, uh, a TBI Caprice um, door panel bezel that will, Dave got for his custom cruiser. A Roadmaster sedan license plate bracket filler piece. And look at this. The rare, although not desirable, but rare, uh, manual controls from a 94 to 96 Roadmaster. Let's see what else we have up here. Uh, I don't actually know what's in this bag. Do you know what this is? Oh, visors. Visors for Dave's Lucerne. Um, A-pillars, I think, for the Lucerne. Uh, another piece of B-body run channel molding, the back parts of the seats for the Lucerne, um, oh, the uh, Roadmaster side uh, belt line trim, Roadmaster sedan tail lights. Moving on to the other side of the pile. Let's see, what do we got? Oh, uh, rear tailgate trim panel for my custom cruiser. A blue 94 dash faceplate for a, or 95 96 dash plate faceplate for a Roadmaster. More old 98 bumper fillers for friend of Dave's. Uh, and uh, the headrests that go with the Lucerne seats. 
a uh, camel colored cargo cover for a wagon, a maple red cargo cover for my wagon, uh, a couple sets of black steering wheel audio controls that fit this wheel here, which is going to be modded into uh, one of the custom cruisers. Some trim, rocker trim panels for uh, my custom cruiser. And then check this out. I got a CB radio cassette player out of an 84 Cadillac. I'm going to put that in my Pontiac. Ah, a whole bunch of these. The limited, the light up limited, um, some of them don't say limited, the older ones. Light up uh, opera lights. A trunk switch from a TBI Caprice, which can be modded for whatever the hell you want in a wagon because there's no need for that switch, but there's a blank for it. Door, door handle for my Crown Vic. Brackets for the cargo shades for the wagons. Um, more rocker trim. And that's a wheel I just mentioned. Uh, found these perfectly, perfectly clean uh, wood grain trim pieces for my Country Squire. Dave bought a whole bunch of compass temp mirrors for what I don't know, selling I guess. And uh, what else, what else? There's some more old steering wheel controls. What else, what else? I think that's everything. So uh, yeah, that was a pretty fully loaded wagon. Look at all this stuff. Sure is a haul. Yeah, amazing.